वेलकम टू डॉक्टर बी आर अम्बेडकर ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी हैदराबाद टुडे वी एम बॉक ऑन अ कैप्टिवेटिंग जर्नी थ्रू द इलास्ट्रियस हिस्ट्री एंड एक्स्ट्रॉडनरी अकॉम्प्लिशमेंट ऑफ दिस एस्टीम्ड इंस्टीट्यूशन द आंध्र प्रदेश ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी होल्ड द डिस्टिंक्शन ऑफ बींग द फर्स्ट ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी established in india in 1982 by an act of the andhra pradesh state legislature the visionaries behind this educational endeavor were the then chief minister of andhra pradesh sri bhavanam venkatram and the then education minister of andhra pradesh sri k keshavrao inaugurated by the former president of india sri gyani jail singh on august 26 1982 the university set out to revolutionize higher education by embracing distance education professor g ramreddy a dedicated institution builder and visionary introduced the concept of distance education to democratize higher education in india as a founder vice chancellor of andhra pradesh open university and the indira gandhi national open university igno he played a pivotal role in legitimizing distance higher education in the country the foundation stone for the buildings of the university was laid by dr shankar dayal sharma former vice president of india on july 2nd 1988 on the panoramic site of jubilee hills speaking on this occasion the then chief minister sri nandamuri tarakarama rao said उपस्थित <laughs> The university was renamed as Dr. B R Ambedkar Open University in 1991 to commemorate the centenary celebrations of Dr. B R Ambedkar, the architect of Indian Constitution. Situated amidst the serene surroundings of Hillock and Durgam Cheru Lake, the university's buildings were constructed for providing higher educational opportunities to marginalized and underprivileged sections of the society. The buildings were inaugurated by the then Prime Minister of India, Sri P V Narasimharao, on 31st August 1994. The studies about open university. the open university system as a system the curiosity uh, about the system the desire to learn about the system to examine it to get into details all this was done in andhra pradesh even before 1982 82 was the culmination of all this effort the culmination of all these trials and tribulations and because it was the first university it has a first to its credit but to the credit of andhra pradesh goes the entire hard work that went into the making of an open university boasting various branches like administration and learner support services academic center of staff training and development professor g ramreddy center of research and development Center for Internal Quality Assurance, Electronic Media Resources and Research Center, EMR and RC and Library, Materials and Publications Division, Science and Technology, Multifunctional Laboratory, Examination. The university aims to provide quality and comprehensive educational support to the students to enrich their lives for the convenience of students. The university has created necessary facilities like post office, state bank, Xerox center, Misewa online fee payment, canteen, and guest house for outstation students, etc. Over the years, several distinguished vice chancellors 
including Professor G. Ram Reddy, Professor C. Narayana Reddy, Professor R. V. R. Chandrasekhar Rao, Professor S. Bashiruddin, Professor Afzal Muhammad, Professor V. S. Prasad, Professor D. Ramachandram, Professor O. R. Reddy, Dr. P. Prakash, and Professor K. Sita Ramarao have contributed immensely for the growth and development of the university. The only path of dharma will provide us the highest form of wealth. The highest form of wealth, in my opinion, is knowledge and awareness about the society and serving the society. Embracing an open learning system, the university extends its reach to the tribal and backward areas, marginalized sections of society with skilled and unskilled workers, housewives, jawans, and prison inmates for providing access to higher education while earning a livelihood. The university operates through an extensive network of 176 learner support centers spread across both Telugu states, located primarily in government and government-aided colleges, starting with a humble beginning of 6,231 students the university enrolls about 1,30,000 students every year, making higher education more accessible to a wider sections of society. The university has the distinction of being known as one of the mega universities. To further its commitment to reach the unreached, the university established the Audiovisual Production and Research Center in 1986. In 2022, the center was rechristened as Electronic Media Resource and Research Center. This center has facilities of production of radio and video lessons in coordination with academic faculty and organizes transmissions through public service broadcasting agencies like All India Radio and TSAT. Additionally, all the video lessons are uploaded on BREOU YouTube channel and website. Through its web radio streaming stations called Sarvatrika Vidyavani, the university ensures continuous availability of subject-wise lessons, playing 24-7, contributing to an inclusive educational experience for all the learners. In conclusion, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar Open University stands as a beacon of education where the learners needs and aspirations are given paramount importance embodying the transformative vision of dr b r ambedkar the institution's dedication to provide education for all reflects its belief in equal opportunities and social justice by recognizing knowledge and awareness as the true assets of society the university empowers individuals to grow intellectually and contribute meaningfully to their communities. Through its unwavering commitment to fostering an egalitarian society, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar Open University continues to be a driving force for positive change, shaping a brighter and more inclusive future for all. My name is Rukmini. I completed my undergraduation uh, from B. R. Ambedkar Open University in the year 2020 in the stream of uh, commerce. Uh, the books provided are extremely helpful. Yeah, my name is Bhagyavar Shankar. I have completed MSc Zoology here. Uh, so I feel very proud, prestige to complete MSc Zoology at B.R. Ambedkar University. This is Mamata. I got a gold medal in uh, MSc Botany. So here I did the uh, my post-graduation in botany. Here, the uh, faculty and the facilities are also very good. I am Shabana. I am coming from Udaygiri, Nellur district. I have done degree in Ambedkar Open University. The story behind my gold medal is the teaching staff. I am Mr. Borkar VL, serving as a junior commissioned officer in Army Ordnance Corps since 25 years. Right now, I am undergoing a diploma in personal management course from Dr. B. R. Ambedkar University, which is very reputed in the country. I have a degree in discontinued, I open university, I have a degree in the first time, 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 I have a degree in the first
నెక్స్ట్ పీజీ కూడా చేయాలనుకుంటున్నాను 